Hey, what's up, guys? Drak here. Thank you for tuning in to one of my another one of my videos. Today, I'm gonna be prank calling McDonald's over in Stillwater. I'm gonna be complaining about the no gloves issue that I always have with them constantly, and the mayo tasting a little off. So, there's two of them there. So I'm gonna call the first one if they're not too busy. Um, yes, can I speak to the manager, please? Um, I come in, uh, the other day, and I had a, a little, and I have an issue with some of the employees. Had an issue with some of the employees. Uh, just the other day, as a matter of fact, sometime Friday, on Friday last week sometime, and Except I went come to the drive through and but I could see but I saw inside and the people wasn't wearing gloves and as soon as I got home the mayo tasted off a little odd. The what? I mean I saw I saw some of the employees wasn't wearing gloves. Excuse me? Yeah, I mean I mean, I saw some of the employees wasn't wearing gloves, and also whenever I got it home, I mean, it was, the mayo tasted a little off. So what tasted a little off? The, ma the mayo. Oh, our mayo is a brand new every day, sir. Oh. I'm like, it's brand new every day, it's got, got a taste on it, um, and the employees are required to wear gloves unless they're sleeping or something like that. Then they gotta wash their hands before they come back on the floor. Uh, yes. Yeah, so, did, did you go to the one on 6th Street or the one on McKill? I mean, maybe you went to the one on 6th Street. I'm not sure. Which which McDonald's you go to? I went to the one I'm calling now, as a matter of fact. Oh, McKill, right? Yeah. Okay. Sometimes people call us when they need to call 6th Street. Yes, yeah, like I saw some of them not wearing gloves, and that's it's an issue I've had for a very long time. I can barely hear you. I'm sorry. I mean, I saw them. I there is a few I saw not wearing gloves, and it's an issue I've been having for a very long time. I am so sorry. Do you mind coming in and talk to me because it's hard for me over the telephone to to hear exactly what you're saying. Yeah, I, yeah, I can do that. I'll be in Stillwater today. I'm fine. Yeah, I can do that. I'll be in Stillwater today. Okay, well, I'll be here till five. All right. Okay, thank you. Yep. She got pissed. Just the way I planned. Well. Heard it first on the prank call to McDonald's in, on McGillery Street in Stillwater, Oklahoma. She got pissed off. She's like, no, they, our employees always wear gloves. But get this, whether or not they're sleeping. What the hell kind of place are they running? It's like, that gives the employees a big opportunity to just take someone's order before they get it out and just completely ruin it. Like, like, come on, don't let your employees sleep on the job. You know what? I mean, if that were me, that slept on the job, I'd get fired in a heartbeat. She said sweeping. Sweeping, not sleeping. Sounded like sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> She said the only time that they don't have to wear gloves is when they're sweeping. That's not true. They have to wear gloves either way. Hey guys, one more thing before I end the video right there from the last prank call. If there's anybody else y'all 
like me to prank call, just leave a comment in the description below. I mean, it can be anybody. A restaurant, a police department, make sure it's out of state so they can't trace, track my number and find it and arrest me. Uh, uh, somebody that might have pissed you off, I mean, just, I mean, somebody just put their name and phone number down in the comment section. I'll give them a call, Give maybe give them a little scare, you know. And I'll make sure to give a shout out to y'all to let y'all know, hey, this was y'all's request. I'm doing it. So, thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, please hit that like button. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. And have a nice day.